Well, good evening, greetings, and salutations. This is Passionate Bliss, and I'm here again tonight with questions, comments, useless facts about me. But first, go to my YouTube channel, Passionate Bliss. Comment, like, subscribe, share, and I will talk to you over there. Looking forward to it, okay? My full YouTube video will always be on my YouTube channel. Tonight, I just had some questions about um, being paid what you're owed. Are you a person who pays what you owe? Who is it that we really owe? And by virtue of living in this world, what do we owe to the world we live in? Okay, and my quote for tonight came from Voltaire. He said, to the living we owe respect, but to the dead, we owe the truth. What did he mean by that? Tell me what you think he meant by that, okay? Because um, I'm just gonna answer those questions and you'll find out personal facts about me, useless ones. Um, do I feel what I owe? Do I pay what I owe? Debt collectors, I pay them what I feel like I owe them. If I don't feel like I owe them all that stuff, <laughs> they'll get it when they get it. But the thing is that I always pay them. I just don't pay them on time. If something else comes up and be as a priority, they'll get paid second. That single mom mentality. That single mom vulture. No, no child support ever from anyone. Okay? Everybody getting paid. They didn't get paid on time. And I ain't really worried about it because it's never stopped me from getting anything I wanted to get anyway. But yeah. I pay what I owe, eventually. Um, as far as taxes, you got to pay that or he coming for your neck. So I do pay my taxes. I owe that. I pay it. Some of us don't think so. Long list of celebrities I let, I let off with last week. Who don't want to pay their taxes? I do pay my taxes, okay? Um, let's see. Who do we really owe by living in this world? First and foremost, you owe yourself, okay? You owe it to yourself to protect yourself, to look out for yourself to um, grow, to learn, to be your best, to do your best, to learn from your mistakes and stop repeating your mistakes. You owe that to yourself, okay? First and foremost, you owe something to you. Okay, secondly, uh, we owe our loved ones. The people who brought us here, tried to love us the best they knew how. The people we brought here, and that we tried to love them the best we knew how. And then those by extension, who were added on as we went along the way. You know, we owe it to them. What do we owe them? Our loved ones, families, friends that we picked up. We owe them our love. Um, people define love in different ways. Some things that look like love to some people don't look like love to me at all. Some things that sound like love to some people don't sound like love to me at all. Um, we owe them our love. Do the best you can. And when you learn how to love better, then do better, okay? But we owe them our love. Sometimes, though, the ones who don't learn to do better and be better, we have to love them from a distance, okay? We do what we can for them from over here, okay? <laughs> so sometimes we have to love from a distance, and that's okay. That's okay. We owe them loyalty, our loved ones, our friends, the people we picked up, people we brought here, people who brought us here. We owe them our loyalty, okay? We would not put someone else outside over them. We owe them our loyalty, okay? Um, not blind loyalty, but loyalty, okay? We owe them our protection. We owe them our protection. Um, one of our basic human needs is to feel safe. And we owe them our protection, and we owe them a place where they can feel safe, even if they have to feel safe to talk to me, to feel safe to, you know, come stay with you, to feel safe to, you know, to, um, you know, give and take from you. We owe them the ability to feel safe and to feel protected emotionally, mentally, physically when they're in our presence. Okay, we owe them our protection. Okay, um, what else do we owe them? We owe them our support. Okay, get behind them. If they're a young black entrepreneur, get behind them, support them. If they're in college, support them. Give them $20. They always broke and they're eating ramen noodles. Okay. Throw them a little 20, you know, support them, you know. Um, whatever it is they're trying, if they're in college, support them. If they're, you know, trying to start a family, new mom, buy the baby pampers every now and then, show up with bottles of milk, whatever, you know, support. Support where you can, when you can, you know. And you'll find that people will want to support you back when it's your turn and you're in need, <laughs> okay. Um, show kindness, show kindness. The world around us and outside of us is brutal. It's hard enough. We don't need our own people, our own family members, and our own friends being unkind, 
Okay, because we're going to get that when we walk out the door anyway. So I don't need you in my house being unkind to me. Be kind. Be kind to your friends and your family. If they're your loved ones, if you love them, be kind. Okay? <laughs> affection. Give them affection. It's one of our basic human needs is affection. Touch them for no reason. Give them a kiss when you see them. Give them a kiss when you leave them. Give them a hug. Show them affection. There's a basic human need. You should not be starving for affection when you have a family. I used to force kisses on my children. They used to run from me. <laughs> That's how I used to get rid of them. I was like, come give mommy some sugar. They would take off out of my room. Okay, affection. They could never say the mother was not affectionate. <laughs> so, give them affection. Even if they run from it. <laughs> okay. Um, and, and what do we owe society? By virtue of the fact that this is the world that we live in, what do we owe society? I feel like we owe society to be productive. Do not try to deliberately drain society. Okay, now if you giving your best to society and you're, you know, retired, and it's your turn to receive, a, you know, a, some, some rest and a pension or whatever, then do that. But don't drain society unnecessarily. You owe it to society to be productive, contribute, pay your taxes, okay? Be productive and contribute. We owe justice to society. Okay, if we want to receive justice, we have to be just to other people. And even if people aren't just to you, try to be just to them. Okay, society should be a just place, as just as we can make it. Okay? And we owe it to the world, the planet itself, to take care of it. And we have not done a very good job of that. And we, when I say that, I mostly mean the wealthy who've polluted it with their businesses and their greed. Um, but uh, we owe it to our world to, that we're to take care of it. If you have a yard, take care of your yard. I have a yard, man. When I can get him to come, he comes. I ain't, I ain't cutting, I ain't doing no manual labor outside. But, you know, uh, take care of the area around you. <laughs> Make sure your house is kept up, all that kind of good stuff, to the best of your ability now. Just take care of your little piece of the world that you got, okay? And um, with that being said, Whatever you do, whoever you owe, when you pay, may it all be done in love. Whatever you do, let it be done in love. With that being said, y'all have sweet dreams. Wait to find them all real.